couple steps up to the plate, and he rips one down the left field line, and this ball is gone. Serrano just hit his first home run of the year, a line shot that hit off of the Budweiser Solid Rock rooftop deck area. Got out of here in a hurry, and the Woodchucks now lead one to nothing. Here's his first pitch to Hayden. He swings and lines went into left center field. This is going to score Brooks Braga. Phileas Snyder will hold up at second. The throw comes into second. But Phileas Snyder able to dive back into the base as Braga scores, and it's 2-0. Runner takes off for third. The pitch is grounded up the middle to his left. Carter dives, can't make the play. It's into center field. Now bobbled out there by Braga. Howard ends up at third base. The stretch by Trout, 0-1. Swinging a liner down the left field line, it stays fair. Karam's off the TDS triple play club and it will score a run. Ruvacamp digging for second, the throw there is off target. And Ruvacamp has a two out RBI double. And the Mallards have tied it up at two apiece. Just a sharp rocket down that left field line. It stayed fair, immediately kicked into foul territory, hit off the corner of the TDS triple play club. Trout works from the windup. His first pitch is a wild pitch all the way to the screen. Zimmerman will score standing up, and the Mallards now lead 3-2. to two. Rubicamp advances to third on the wild pitch. And now things are coming unglued for the Wisconsin Woodchucks. Gets second base and the pitch. Swinging a ground ball through the hole on the right side for a base hit. Braga's going to round third, try to score. The throw by Marikov comes home. It's not going to be in time as Braga slides around Ruvikamp. And Hayden delivers once again. It's his second RBI hit of the ball game and we are tied at three. One, two pitch. Rivercamp swings and lines one into right center field for a base hit. Rounding third and trying to score is Zimmerman. He will score with ease as Rivercamp took the wide turn at first. Now has to scamper back to the bag. Nobody covering up first behind him. But it's a two run, two strike single for Mike Rivercamp. And the Mallards reclaim the lead. It's now 5-3. Second inning comes set. A one pitch. Breaking ball is hit in the air to left center field. Giving chase is Braga. He'll give way to the left fielder Munoz. Tagging and scoring from third is Nick Howard, and it's now 6-3 Madison. Aaron, uh, Shaft struck me out. Richard Roundtree. <laughs> Swinging a ground ball up the middle. This one's going to make its way through into center field for a base hit. It's going to score a run. RBI base hit for Jackson Lowry, and the Wisconsin Woodchucks will cut into the Mallard lead. It's now 6-4 Madison. The one-two pitch by Livingston, swinging a ground ball up the middle. It's into center field for a base hit, rounding third, heading for home. Here is Lowry. The throw will come into the shortstop. And Jack Livingston has given up the lead. The ball game is now tied at six runs apiece after the two-run RBI single by Madison Carter. His 17th and 18th RBI of the season. The look over at third and the 0-1 pitch. Swinging a ground ball, base hit into right field, and that'll do it. Walk-off single by Jake Reese, and the Mallards win in their final home game of the year, 7-6. to six.